Um, what's the strength of the movie in this the final chapter? For, according to you, what's the strength of the movie? Oh, that it's um, it's taken it several steps further. It's uh, so much larger than life. You kind of get to see Lisbeth as a not like a hero, but but a bit more. You get to know the reasons why she is as she is. Kind of. So very human, but kind of heroic also. But I think I like this Batman Begins Casino Royale, where you get to know why the guy is the way he is, you know? So I love that, and I think this movie does that, yeah. Casino mm. Royale. evil characters without telling too much are feminist in a way, because women can be evil. Uh, oh, yeah, women can be very evil. And uh, you have them here also. <laughs> Is there something as the greater good as in your character? Do you think that there's always uh, that we can always sacrifice somebody in order to get something greater? Oh, that's history has shown that that's very possible. Uh, and of course, so in films like this, it's uh, you have to imagine that you're able to do that, which is quite quite hard. I think for my character, it's not it's not that she's so against Lisbeth Salander or her beliefs or her ideas or ideas of justice. It's more it's more that she is she want she doesn't want chaos. She and she's a diplomat. She really wants to keep things uh, in order. That can be a strong force too <laughs> in women. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, I'm okay. Okay. Oh, you play the historic role of Michael Bronkowitz because me, in the past I met uh, me and Michael Bronkowitz, a great actor. Uh, what's the difference uh, you have choice in, in the character of the new, of the, this part very famous? Oh, the, the difference is uh, it's me. Uh, I'm, uh, it's me doing it. And if you change the actor, you're always gonna use so much of yourself, so it's going to be a completely different thing. It's hard to copy. What do you think? Uh, this uh, is a very different from the other uh, movie, the other uh, also on, on, on the book. It is a very action movie. Also, your character is completely different. Uh. I think I think uh, this movie has a lot of uh, tension and speed and, and action, and, and uh, I think that kind of. Uh, lifts the Millennium Universe in a good way. Okay. Thank you. Does that affect the life of your character? Oh, she uh, she she fuels my character. She uh, Lisbeth is uh, Mikael's uh, dragon poison. She she gives him energy to to go on. I think uh, uh, she's the only one he can trust, and, and vice versa. Is it true that there's no Michael Bloomberg without this person? Yeah, definitely. Um, I really enjoyed, one of the main things I enjoyed about the character was uh, her non-judgmental attitude, her freedom about her sexuality, about uh, her beliefs, about what she deemed to be right and wrong. She had very strong morals, um, but within that she, she had an amazing amount of kind of uh, non-judgment and freedom about the world that she lived in. Tiara? What do you think weighs more, a tiara or a gun? Um, I don't know, you'd have to put them both on a weighing scale. And like... Uh, from your, your feelings, in terms of feelings, and the weight of the character, I mean, what was... Um, I mean, they're both very, very different parts. They both have their challenges, they both had um, things that I absolutely loved and things I had to really work at getting right, um, but, uh, but I love playing both women. Hello.